State lawyers and Republican leaders have said it is illegal and impossible to decertify the results of the 2020 election in Wisconsin. But that didn't stop two Republican lawmakers headlining a rally at the Capitol today, continuing to ask Speaker Robin Voss to do just that. Our Naomi Coles is there with more. Naomi? I counted about 200 people at that rally, at, about, at, at the height of the rally, I should say, happening at the rotunda behind me. Now, headlining this event, two GOP state lawmakers, Representative Tim Ramthun. He, of course, just announced his bid for governor with Mike Lindell's support. And then secondly, also Representative Janelle Branchen. Now, also some other election conspiracy theorists spoke to the crowd. There were signs saying things like, quote, Trump won and calling out Assembly Speaker Robin Voss. The goal of the rally, trying to get Republican leaders to greenlight a resolution that would decertify the election that of course, they have said is illegal and they won't. I'm not conspiracy. Where's the cameras? They're all over, right? I'm not conspiracy. I'm into truth. I want justice and closure on the details of the mechanics of our process. It doesn't matter who's on the ballot. What matters is what's the effect on the voter. In multiple lawsuits, recounts in Dana, Milwaukee counties, and two election reviews. The 2020 election has been audited, reviewed, and upheld over and over again. Now, all of this comes on a very busy day in the state capitol. There was a massive Senate floor session. They gave the green light to a number of bills that would send them to the governor's desk. Also, the annual State of the State, of Adre uh, state, of the state Address, Governor Eber scheduled to give that later this evening. We'll be bringing you coverage of that all through tonight's shows and online at channel3000.com. Busy day at the Capitol, Naomi Coles reporting live. Naomi, thank you.